Established in 1626, the town of Salem, Massachusetts was a thriving farming and fishing community. The people in this colonial town lived a simple life of hard work and Puritan faith. But in 1692, religious fervor turns into fear. It all begins in the home of Salem's esteemed church leader, Samuel Parris. The first afflictions happened in Reverend Paris's household. Paris's daughter, Betty, and his niece, Abigail Williams, began acting strange. They had convulsions. These girls were under a malady which scared the hell out of a lot of the adults. The girls would contort into all sorts of contortions that just weren't normal. They would often run towards the fireplace as if to burn themselves up. In some cases, it's reported that bite marks occurred on their bodies, and they were really sick. The family used home remedies. They called in doctors, physicians, and they prayed for them. The girls' afflictions were so scary, were so true, that they didn't believe these were normal, these were natural. These had to be supernatural. Finally, one of the doctors said they must be under an evil hand, which means a curse, witchcraft. 